everyone, welcome to the gallery and today we're going to do a post review of the of this diamond painting that I just finished today. It is of a sewing machine. If you saw my unboxing, uh, you'll remember that this would is going to be a gift for my mom and I just finished just in time uh, for Mother's Day and uh, I think it's just beautiful. Before I carry on, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button, click on the like button, let me know you like my videos, and um, share if you think someone else would be interested in watching my content. So uh, this I got from Amazon. I don't know, remember, I think I purchased it last month in February, late February. This diamond painting has 21 colors and it's beautiful. It has a lot of confetti. Um, it took me about two and a half weeks to do, uh, on and off. Um, it gave me a few headaches because of all the confetti, like there was just constant. It came out really well. Um, it's a little pixelated in certain places, but that's fine. So here I have a coffee cup or a tea cup. There is a uh, tape measure here. I think this is um, material hanging off of the table. This is an old-fashioned singer. That's what that says. Um, you know, the, the wording came out pretty good. And just lift it up so you can see it shining. I think this is, um, like this is in a room and this would probably be drapes or something. This is a uh, material that this person is working on. So yeah, it had a lot of confetti. Um, especially in here. This was a lot of changing of colors. That's what confetti means. Um, yeah, so it turned out pretty good through the camera. It looks really good in person. It's a little pixelated, but you can tell what everything pretty much is. Um, yeah, so it was a very nice diamond painting to do. I hope my mom likes it and she can hang it up in her sewing room. Uh, the only thing I didn't like about this painting is these numbers, and I was wearing glasses, and they were a little blurry. Uh, they became a little blurry after a while, but thank God I had done bags, and I had written everything down, but I still refer to it once in a while, make sure I'm getting the right color out. Um, yeah, so it was a really nice, it's a 35 by 35, and I'm thinking of getting maybe a black frame for this to frame it for my mom i'm not sure i'm going to seal it hopefully the frame i get will have glass and i won't have to seal it i'm going to put it under some heavy books to flatten um and make sure all the uh diamonds are in place and i have plenty of time before mother's day to make sure this is flat keeping it flat and uh hopefully she will enjoy it so this was uh i would say this was like a eight out of ten it looks beautiful through the camera, but it's a little pixelated in person, like I said. So there's a couple of spots in this picture that I'm not really sure why these particular colors went down, but I didn't mess it up. Um, but it's pretty cute, and uh, hopefully she'll enjoy it and she'll hang it up in her room. So um, I hope you enjoyed this. Time. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please uh, subscribe, like I said. Hit the like button down below. Tell your friends about my channel, please do, and I hope to see you again. I'm going to be working on the apple with the roses inside next. If you didn't see my unbagging of those of that diamond painting in this one, go check it out. I'll link it down below. And until then, please have a great day, and I will see you on my next video. Thanks, everyone. I did forget to mention that I did I did not use up all of my diamond diamonds. Um, they all of them were accounted for. I did not run out whatsoever. So I just wanted to make sure that you knew that.